Hello everybody, Adam here for True North Wilds. I have a new unboxing series for you starting with this video. Before I get to that though, a couple quick announcements. First off, the winner of my giveaway that is featured at the top of my channel, uh, or has been featured at the top of my channel for the last couple weeks, is a little embarrassing in the sense that I picked May 12th because I thought that was the opening day of fishing here in Manitoba. You would think that would be something that I would know, of all things. It was actually the May 9th, so it doesn't quite line up with fishing season start. But the winner of that giveaway, which as a reminder is this massive box of tackle, is the commenter uh, with the username Carson King. So I will be contacting you, Carson King, if you are watching, or feel free to contact me. Either way, we'll get that sent out as uh, soon as we can and get all the info. Congratulations on that. This is a lot of stuff. Um, I'm excited to see any pictures you might have of receiving that because there's some good stuff in there. Moving on, next uh, thing I want to quickly say, you might notice that I am dressed very brightly today. Got this awesome orange shirt. Fish bones from simplefishing.ca. Uh, all profits for these fish bones t-shirts goes to the Canadian Food Bank Emergency Fund to uh, help fill in the gaps. Uh, there's a lot of demand right now, especially with COVID. Uh, donations are down. People still need food, uh, and, and of course with people not working as much, there's uh, an increased demand. So really good cause, um, all, the, all the profits going towards that. They raised 175 in April, uh, and the goal is $200 for May. So buy a t-shirt, help out a great cause, and I gotta admit they are very comfortable t-shirts, nice, good quality fabric, and uh, they come in a whole range of colors too. As I mentioned in my channel update, I want to get into a more of a general outdoors vibe for the channel, move a little bit away from the pure fishing stuff. To start that off, I am getting a new box. This is the Sportsman's Box, sportsmansbox.com if you want to check them out online. Uh, I picked this one because it's a general outdoors box. I'm supposed to come with a little bit of fishing stuff, some hunting stuff, some camping stuff, just general outdoors feel to it. Uh, a mix of everything, so I'm excited for that. This box is $42 US per month. For me, that's $59 Canadian. They have a huge version that's $83 US per month, uh, but is big and you can get trail cameras and game calls and, and reels and clothing and all that stuff. Uh, this is the mid-size box and then there's also a smaller box and I don't remember offhand how much that one was, it's 20 something dollars a month. So I went for the mid-range one just to check it out. Uh, I got a, I think a, either a three or a six month subscription, I don't recall exactly, but uh, I got a subscription for a period of time, I'm going to try it out for that period of time, see what I think of it and maybe carry on with it, but I'm excited. Let's uh, go ahead and take a look at this. The one thing I will say right off the bat though, this is the box, uh, which caught me by surprise because this is just a white shipping box, and I already opened it saw that there was all the items inside and I didn't look at them, I shut it quickly because I wanted to be surprised by what's in here. But uh, no branding on this box, there's no... which is weird because on their website it shows branded sportsman's boxes. So we'll see how the next ones go or maybe it's just because it's crossing customs, it's different or... don't know, couldn't tell you, but if this is what the box looks like, sportsman's box, your uh, branding game is weak right now. However, it's what's inside that counts. So. Let's take a look. I'm excited. Alright. Your first sportsman's box. Oh cool. So the little because it's my first one, so some promotional stuff here. Uh discount codes, a bunch of info on there. That's kinda neat. Alright. Looks like some decent stuff in here right off the bat. I mean it's a uh, it's got a few big items in here, that's nice to see. So we have, what is this? Scent cartridge, synthetic scent cartridge, citronella, oh, uh, mosquito repellent, insect repellent, bug off mist from Hunter's Cloak is the brand. Never heard of them. Does it have, uh, yeah, it's bug repellent. Citronella bug repellent. And it looks, oh, I guess I could look at what else is, I was going to say, it looks like it has a little connection point here. It's an electronic mister, that's why, I was a little confused here of how this was supposed to work. It's electronic mister from Hunter's Cloak Mist System. Uh, insect repellent, so I guess you clip this onto your belt. 
or you can set it beside you. That's neat. So it's, I mean, most people are familiar with like thermocells and other area insect repellents. Kind of neat that uh, to get one in a box, to be honest. Rechargeable battery. Got the uh, extra scent cartridge for it. Char it comes with a charging cable. Has a whole bunch of different scents that you can get for it. Oh, oh, I get it. I get it. This is actually really cool. So, it's a mist system with a bunch of different scents. So the one that it came with here is an earth scent. So for hunting, you put it up with you and you can cover your scent. It's like spraying a scent off or spraying a scent on yourself. Same idea, just it's an area around you with this electronic mister. And then this is a different cartridge you can get. This one is a insect repellent, a citronella insect repellent. And then you can get other different scents uh, as well. So that's pretty cool. I'm not gonna open that because it, the package looks insanely <laughs> tight and uh, I don't want to mist inside the house anyway. But that's pretty cool. I like the idea of that with the exchangeable cartridges. That's neat. I haven't really seen anything like that locally, so I'm happy with that. Next up, we have the Flex Tone Buck Commander Rut Hunter. Uh, a call. Ah, I like this. Calling tips on the back. Comes with a little CD with, uh, I guess tips on how to use it and some action-packed three action-packed hunts with examples and tips cool <laughs> not bad I like that I'm gonna definitely look at those tips I'm actually in need of a new call so this will be great for hunting season and it feels like durable the problem I have with uh, the other ones that I've been getting, the last two I broke really quickly because they're the kind that have the flexible plastic tube on them and that tube got kinked and the reed inside got bent and was never the same after that. This is all like flexible rubber material and I don't see this getting damaged or broken very easily if at all. So I'm happy with that. I think that's really cool and happens to be something that I need right now. Last up, so only the three items in this box. I guess this counts as four items, maybe. Uh, so an HME fixed blade knife with gut hook. Always be prepared. A better line of hunting accessories. Well, I like knives. I do collect sort of knives and blades of all types. So I'm not going to say no to a knife in my box, that's for sure. Comes with some tools. Probably for uh, working the, the handle. So it comes with this paracord handle. Kind of neat. Painted with the lime green and the black design. Decent knife shape, decent size. It's got a can opener on the back end. I like that. I drink a lot of beer. I mean, I'm always using can openers. Uh, got your thumb grooves on the back. Not bad. It's fairly light. Fairly light. I don't know what kind of metal it is or anything like that. Comes with a thermoplastic sheath, is what it says. I don't see a sheath. I know they don't mean the packaging. So. Yeah, on the back here it's got a picture of the sheath with a belt clip on it. That would have been nice. That would have been nice. Yeah, I am not just blind, there is no sheath in this package. Uh, so that's a bit disappointing. The knife itself... Feels sharp. Sharp enough. Like I said, I don't exactly know what metal it is or anything like that. It's a stainless steel type 420 SS. I don't really know my metals all that well. It doesn't feel like a super high quality knife, but I mean, for something as a just a little utility knife or something that I would wear on my belt around camp or something to just do a little grunt work, uh, if it would have came with the sheath and the belt clip, I probably would wear it and try it out. But uh, without the sheath and without the belt clip, this is going to be something that just kind of lays around uh, on my desk for if I need to cut something quickly, <laughs> uh, unfortunately. 
So, a little bit of a miss with that. That's uh, kind of amazing to me that... And it wasn't like this was opened, it was, uh, it was still sealed. So, just from the manufacturer, I guess, came without the sheath. Interesting. So that's a little disappointing. It's a little disappointing that I only got the uh, three items in here. I also am a little bit disappointed that there is no, like, what's in the box card or anything that tells, like, lists what these things are and their retail value. Most subscription boxes uh, that I've had experience with will include that as a default. Uh, this does not have that, so they they push their website here a lot. Maybe they list their stuff on their website. I'm not sure. I'll have to. I'll look closer into that. But uh, yeah, you know what? Mediocre box so far. My first impression is I'm not blown away. Uh, it's cool. The items are cool. I like the call. This is a neat thing to have. It's a cool idea. The knife is kind of. It's a cheap knife, and it didn't come with the sheath. So you know, all in all, kind of a mediocre box to start off with. The knife is kind of, it's a cheap knife and it didn't come with the sheath. So, you know, all in all, kind of a mediocre box to start off with. We'll see how the next ones go. Um, if they're all, if they all end up being sort of like this, I don't think, I don't see this subscription lasting that long on my channel, but maybe the next ones will be better, we'll see. The items themselves, as far as the call and this uh, mister go, they're, they're decent. So, I can't really complain too much about those, but it would be nice to have a what's in the box card so I can compare values. I'm going to have to go and look these up online and, and kind of get a feel for it. But yeah, let me know in the comments what do you guys think if you, uh, if anyone's blown away where I'm not or, or if you have a worse opinion of it than I do. I'm, uh, I'm on the fence right now uh, as far as uh, I'm looking to forward to seeing what the next one brings because I hope it's better than this. Let me know down in the comments. Again, congratulations to our giveaway winner, Carson King. And again, don't forget simplefishing.ca to buy a fish bones t-shirt and help the um, Canadian uh, Food Bank Emergency Fund. Sportsmansbox.com if you want to check these guys out online. Don't forget to hit those like and subscribe buttons down below. You can follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Uh, I think that's everything. So until next time, I'll see you outside.